I had a friend who as a teenager decided that the finest day of his life, the pinnacle of his very existence, would be the day that he would ride his motorcycle across the Golden Gate Bridge. He painted a compelling vision. He said it would be the 4th of July, a warm breeze would be blowing through his hair, and the sun would be shining, and strangers would longingly stare with both awe and envy. But here's the thing, my friend, he wasn't just a dreamer. He actually saved his money, he bought a motorcycle, he loaded it up with his hopes and his dreams, and he headed out on his journey towards the Golden Gate Bridge. What he didn't expect was how life would turn out when he arrived. I've never forgotten his quest, and in fact, I wrote it into a story called The Other Side of the Bridge. It's a novel about heartbreaking loss, about seeking out hope, about the unexpected trials and tragedies that we face in life, but most important, how we face them. I loved using the Golden Gate Bridge as a backdrop, and I was able to include much of the bridge's rich history, the hardships that the iron workers faced during its construction, and the lessons that they learned. Like the characters in my story, we all have our personal bridges to cross. We all have our goals and our challenges, and oftentimes, like my friend discovered, our own bridge crossings turn out far different than the vision in our heads. It's what we do with that new reality that will make all of the difference. So pack up your things and come with me on a journey. Let's see what life has in store on the other side of the bridge.